Oh, oh, I feel the spirit of worship in the atmosphere this morning. I don't know if you can feel it or not, but when I'm walking in downstairs, I can feel it. When I walked into the Shekinah glory of God, we started walking up the stairs and just kept on. There's something, something that started burning. It's the fire of God. Hallelujah. I say the fire of God is here this morning. Sing that first verse, whatever it is, again. Whatever it is. But I want you to press in this morning. Press in. Don't you dare let the devil hinder you or stop you from getting into the breakthrough that God has for you today. Don't you dare let him stop you. There's many things that the enemy can do. But the only reason they can do it is because you allow it to. See, the devil can't touch you. As children of God, understand He cannot touch you. The only thing that He can do is do what you allow Him to do. So I dare you right now to go ahead and take authority, children of God. Take authority over the enemy in Jesus' name and let Him know no more. I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. I'm a child of the Most High God. I've got royal blood flowing through my veins. I'm sick of being pushed around. Back into a corner. I'm coming out this morning. I'm coming out this morning. I'm going to praise the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. I'm not going to leave the same way I come, but I'm coming in one way. I'm leaving out another. Why? Because God is here today to fill you up. Hallelujah. I'm feeling right now. Praise God. He is here today. And if you want to be changed and transformed, I dare you to press in. Get out of your comfort zone. Throw your hands up in the air. The sound of silence is the sound of defeat. But the sound of shout and rejoicing is the sound of victory. I believe I'm in a room full of people that has victory in their hearts. Why? Because Jesus is on the inside of you. Amen. If you got victory, I wish you let out a big old shout. If I told you I'd seen something that nobody else could see. If I told you that angels had been talking to me, would you merely think me foolish? And my senses are lost. No, I'm just lost in the presence of the sweet Holy Ghost. No, I'm lost in the presence of the sweet Holy Ghost. And He's drawing me closer to the one. i 
Oh,